Hello everyone, I'm Alex and welcome to Expect Ridiculum. If you don't know me, I react to multiple anime, often dressed up as characters or simply wearing different costumes of my own thought and design. Do let me know what you think about my current one. It's time to watch season 4 of the Demon Slayer that we've been waiting for so long. I'm so excited I have the opportunity to cosplay as Nezuko. If you think I've done a good job, smash the like button or drop a message in the comments below. There is currently 26 degrees in my room and I have no air con. Absolutely melting so my makeup might just start to melt off it's really hot i've got a fan on but that is that's not enough gosh i was waiting so long for this season and it was so exciting knowing that i'll be able to cosplay as nezuko i actually thrifted this costume and washing and untangling this mess took me over two hours but it's all fun i'll be like my nails to go up there as well <laughs> So, what we know is that the season 4 will follow on from the end of the Swordsman Village arc by adapting the Hashira training arc and in manga those are chapters 128 until 136. If you watch the trailer, you probably know that we are going to meet all of the Hashiras who will be training the rest of the demon corpse whilst guarding Nezuko. Our lovely and innocent Nezuko is able to walk under the sunlight despite being a full-fledged demon, which is something that Muzan always dreamed about. Imagine if Muzan and the rest of the demons learn about it, acquire the same skill and we'll be able to devour humans in the sunlight. What if the sunlight won't be able to destroy them? I can only imagine that he will be very much after Nezuko's life. So it only makes sense for her to be guarded by the Hashiras, which I'm hoping this is something that we're going to see in this episode. I really can't wait to see Nezuko. Tanjiro, Inosuke, Zdenyutsu and the rest. I'm actually curious to know how long this season is going to be. I think, from what I've learned, the Hashira training arc is actually not that long itself. So I'm guessing it will be about six to eight episodes, but how could they expand it even further? Also, I was a little bit sad when one of you mentioned in the comment that this is the last happy season of Demon Slayer. Now, I don't think any of the seasons was particularly happy at all. If the, but if there is more death awaiting us, I'm not looking forward to that. I really want everyone to made it and all the demons to be eliminated which unfortunately might include Nezuko unless they can find a cure for her. I don't know I've not read the manga so no spoilers please. Nevertheless do let me know your thoughts about this cosplay. If I've done a good job press the like button if you'd like to see more of my reactions with or without a cosplay you know how to subscribe. You can also find this reaction uncut in full opacity and early released on my Patreon linked in the description down below which I highly encourage you to check out or you can become my YouTube member. Hello to all of my YouTube members thanks for support so far and without further ado Let's get on with this episode. Okay, we've got two Hashiras. Okay, so we've got kidnappings made with demons, I'm guessing. It's always so mean. <laughs> oh, they are going to save her. Now there's a one rundown castle. I bet it's swarming with demons. Although we never usually actually see many demons, usually one or two. But that would be a big castle just for one of them. So tell me, we might actually see an upper moon. Destroy. I love his little snake. I really want to see him in action. Both of them, really. Finally, see their powers to the full extent. Oh wow! Well done. Nice. Well, that was quite a lot of them, to be honest with you. <laughs> <laughs> but they've sorted it. Or have they? Yeah, where's the woman that they've kidnapped? Well, it's kind of truth because they couldn't even sense the demon coming, but still, I think he was a bit harsh. <sighs> She's alive. No, that's quite a lot of them. <laughs> Don't tell me if I wipe them all in one strike. Well, that's a Hashira for you, right? No. 
nice. Wow. <laughs> Amazing. It kind of reminds me of Mitsuri's technique. Just a little bit. I wonder if they trained under the same master. Get them! Wow, he's fast. I'm amazed. Look how many of them is there. And they look different. By the way, this is a beautiful scene. Oh, it's just beautifully animated. There's so many of them though. Wow. It's beautiful and deadly. The actual tornado. Oh, wow. Now, this is epic. <laughs> Classic. right on time now this will be your end demon what Muzan's infinite castle don't tell me they are being drawn in there there's no way they could win do you not realize so that that is not happening thankfully they're definitely not ready to face Muzan on his own territory and however many demons I'm surprised to see that this castle can teleport wherever from whenever it's very interesting do we know its mechanism from the previous episodes I'm missing something she's got beautiful eyes and face like you know those Lolita dolls. So cute. Fingers crossed that they finish their training on time and she won't get kidnapped before. Nails are caught. How far is this mansion from the other one where the Hashira are meeting? Should Nezuko really be in care of Apprentice? Wouldn't it make more sense to bring her with them? Quite worrisome in my opinion. Tanjiro! <laughs> Kenpachiro! <laughs> so they've moved. I mean, it was pretty rough, but luckily we had two Hashiras and Tanjiro but us. That scene was epic. You know, no wonder that so many of my friends have started watching anime because of Demon Slayer, and that's what many people have actually told me. <laughs> She's so cute though! I actually wanted to cosplay her, but I was a bit shy about showing off my chest like she does. So, maybe one day, I don't know. <laughs> She's more than okay. Oh my god, I was crying so much in that scene. When she sort of came back to life and fought the curse. I was able to greet the sunlight without burning down. It still like makes me feel emotional. <laughs> A few of them are missing. Oh, back from the mission. It's a shame that uh, 
The other Hashira Rust is um, the flashy one. And I. And he is not a, a full Hashira anymore. <laughs> good to see them all in a good health. <laughs> you must be terrified of you. Oh, they've acquired special marks, haven't they? I know you have a thing for him! <laughs> oh, bless. They are so beautiful. I wonder why her hair are so white. No way, it worsened so much. That's terrible. His illness must have progressed rapidly. I guess they are as shocked as I am. I kind of didn't think that will ever happen, but it was common. I hope this day will never come. Uh-huh. Sorry, but her bird is really funny. <laughs> oh. Every one of them. Wow. Yeah. Okay. So, jealousy? Is that really a good enough reason? A bit suspicious. That would make sense why I afflicted three of them. Is that where Tanjiro, right? He's truly extraordinary. But strangely enough, his hair reminds me of one of the upper ranks, which I was always quite suspicious about, but not another time. Yeah. Obviously, it happened in a very particular moment when they were on the brink of death, right? <laughs> Snap out of it! <laughs> oh, it was beautiful! Come on, you can do it! Tell them! Tell all the time when you turn into a magical girl! <laughs> Oh no, girl, that's no. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> she must be well embarrassed now. I'm kind of embarrassed on your behalf, too. <laughs> Mooney Church, you saved the day. He really was on the brink of death. Wow. That's amazing measurement. 
How does he know his temperature was at 102 degrees? That's a bit tough. I don't think it is. Nasty. Oh, Gyo, you are so mean. Sounds like some sort of bad news, though. Without exception, what? What will happen to them? Wait, don't tell me. If this is bad news and that's what it sounds like. Does it mean that this mark is somehow consuming their life forces? Why is he leaving? He's not a team player, is he? Unless whatever happens, those that awaken Mark is so bad that he doesn't want to be affected, he doesn't want the Mark himself. Can't think of anything else. So does it mean he doesn't want the Mark to appear on him? Just what is it? What is this power? Is it like gravity? Amazing. But why is he crying? And by the way, is he blind? To be honest with you, I would totally eat those hot steamed buns. I love them so much. Animes has always the best food. <laughs> <laughs> no doubt. <laughs> hmm, good to season it so. Oh. Right. A little bit. <laughs> Not the answer you wanted. Kazuko! <laughs> Look at his reaction! <laughs> oh, she's so cute! Oh my god. You just stop being so cute. He can't help them. He can't handle it. Don't say that again. Oh my god, he's fuming. <laughs> he's not just a boar head, he's actually a very handsome guy, but his looks just doesn't go with his body and especially personality. Imovka! Imovka! <laughs> no wonder she said that to Zenitsu. Poor girl, she doesn't know what that means. Um, I don't think his wounds have healed as fast as yours, Tanjiro. 
He's really struggling. Well, he perfected the sword. And he must have taken a proper toll on his body too. Especially with these wounds. Oh, is that God from the Hashira? The fire Hashira. Blah, blah. Blade! <laughs> wow. It's beautiful. It makes an amazing sound as well. Properly dedicated. Wow, that's a real special meaning. Well, it's an amazing sword for an amazing person. Well... Oh, he's so scary. <laughs> so dramatic, though. I swear you are more dramatic than I am. <laughs> oh. Oh my god, you're gonna make a hole in his body. <laughs> what is that? This is ridiculous. <laughs> oh. <clears throat> so to say. Oh. <laughs> nice to see Genya recovering well. Well, mask. I guess he is really excited to see Tanjiro recovered. <laughs> oh, it's that bit that was in the trailer. Bet he can't wait. I wonder if under whom he will be trained. Oh, bless. <laughs> oh, maybe we'll see more of the flashy Hashira. Sorry, I forgot his name. And his wife. <laughs> one by one. Wow. I don't think that's what you meant. That's not the answer he wanted. How do I comment on this? I won't. <laughs> Such a weirdo. Oh, it's gonna melt his heart for sure. Which is very interesting that he can use other breathing techniques. I was very surprised when that happened. It kind of felt a bit like cheating, but obviously, he's not as good as Zenitsu at using this technique. Ah, uh, <laughs> because he will. Ja, <laughs> matane. How come everyone has six packs? It's like an entry level requirement. It's good to see him though. 
harsh. They can barely move though. Oh my gosh. So harsh. Even harsher than that. And why are they dressed so much like that, you know? <laughs> I forgot they used to dress like this, right? It's realistic. <laughs> oh, soften his heart a little bit so he'll be a little bit less harsh. Yeah, that is definitely harsher. And find an equal. Uh, it must be really hard. Things they have to hurry. So will Tanjiro be sent after Giyu to convince him to join the Hashira training? She's taking good care of him, isn't she? She really loves him, I think. He's in a really bad state. I hope we won't see Muzan in this episode. I absolutely hate him. Wait. Isn't that this lady that helps with the blood research? Demon research. He's not there to threaten her, right? I do recognize this Krauss voice. Right. So that means that he might want to form an alliance due to her knowledge. Tanjiro is one of a kind. I think we all agree on that. That's great! She'll be a massive asset if she agrees. Amazing! Finally, there's one in her. I always liked her. She was so helpful. Oh, it's the end of the episode. Good introductory episode. I've enjoyed it. It was good to see Nezuko. All of the Hashiras, Tanjiro, Zenitsu and Inosuke. I'll be honest with you. I am a little bit worried about Nezuko. I hope that they will keep her somewhere close close by to where the Hashira training grounds are because if Muzan gets hold of her this will be the end but what also worries me is that Muzan is able to control demons right so how come he hasn't gained control over Nezuko yet is it because she haven't devoured human blood yet I wonder but the fact that Nezuko is learning new words and you know she's progressing so well it's really good news I'd love to see her being able to convey her feelings and you know be able to in general just have the proper conversation with everyone yeah i'm curious about who is going to be um the one training tanjiro i think master wants tanjiro to speak to giyu and either find out why he's not joining them or somehow convince him to join the hashira training what's really concerning is the reason why why we haven't actually been told what happens after they gained the mark like 
because of how serious it sounded and my suspicion is that this mark will either shorten the lifespan or I don't know because they've said that this this mark sort of reminds of the marks that the demon have so could it be that they somehow come like the demons? Well, surely Mori is needed to turn into a demon, not just that. Or that they will lose control of themselves and go on a rampage? I really don't know. Obviously, I don't want any spoilers, so please don't tell me. If you haven't read the manga, please share your thoughts on this. But if you did read the manga, I don't want to know. We'll find out from the rest of the episodes of this season. Um, yes, if you know how many episodes this season will have, do let me know as I would like to prepare for that. I don't think it will be any more than between 6 and 8 because the uh, Hashira training arc in the manga apparently is uh, quite short. So there's not much of a source material to base this season upon. But I think it will be epic as always. I mean the animation is the music and you just want to watch it you just want to keep watching it thank you so much for watching this episode with me a massive thank you to my patreon isaac and the rest of my patrons actively supporting my channel growth and big thank you to my youtube channel members good to see you around if you're also watching the demon slayer drop the comment below so i know that you like it and if you're not a member of my patreon you're welcome to check the link down below where you can find full opacity uncut early access and patreon exclusive videos and for only five dollars you can also get a shout out at the end of my youtube video be part of discussions exchange direct messages on all sorts it will be good to see you in the next episode so i hope to see you there bye